Hello everyone. Today I would like to show you about my homebrew RF amplifier. Um, first of all, let's take a look at the whole setup. This one is the power supply for my transceiver. The transceiver is King with TKM707. But unfortunately, yesterday I burnt the uh, final stage transistors in my transceiver. You can see those two two SC2879 PMP transistors have been burned and I took them off and uh, this transceiver has one preamp, a middle drive amp and uh, one final amp so I simply uh, use two capacitors to bypass the final amp and uh, so the, the middle drive amp is directly output from here and then through this coax cable to my homebrew amplifier and the output from the amplifier goes to the line section and to my antenna outside and uh, the line section is connected to my watt meter here this is reflected power and forward power uh, I set the forward power you can see 10 watt range for scale 10 watt because I want to measure the output from the transceiver first to show you the input power to my amp amplifier. Um, okay, uh, I need to set the transceiver to the uh, highest power now because uh, the final state has stage has been burnt. Okay. Uh, you can see when I push the PTT button hello hello uh, you can see the forward power simply uh, there is around uh, not until 1 watt uh, around 0 0.5 watt right and now I set it to the lowest power you can see the lowest power and I turn on the uh, the grid, the second grid uh, supply for my vacuum tube. There is actually a, a tetrode tube inside there, so uh, I use the the relay to control the second grid power to control the uh, power uh, to disengage the tetrode or engage the tetrode. Uh, I have pre-tuned the amp, so let's see how this one performs. Uh, oh, I need to set the power to 1kW. You can actually see the needle is uh, have been turned to the left side because the power will be very high. I don't want to uh, hurt my needle, so I simply turn this to the left side. Uh, let's see. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. One, two, three, hello. Hello, hello. One, two, three. You can see the power is over 1kW. Right? Okay, let's turn off the setup and see. And this, take a look at the, at the tube inside, okay? Uh, let me check the temperature. Okay, no problem. I have removed the four screws and uh, simply this is the amplifier and uh, this one here is the tetrode tube. Uh, this one is a high voltage transformer, the high high voltage rectify rectifying to a uh, board and the transmitting and the receiving uh, relays and the power for the first grade negative voltage and the second grade uh, positive voltage and the soft start resistors this is a cancelled current um, shunt and the band switch, the inductor, band inductor and in series with this inductor for the lowest band and the 
呃、uh, plate capacitor, plate tuning capacitor, the loading capacitor, uh, the DC blocking capacitor, the filtering capacitor, the anode choke here, and the blower under here. Uh, the uh, the blower simply um pressurize the whole uh cavity, and uh, you can see I use the tape to cover those holes, so the air only comes from this. Uh, this chamber you can see, so the air uh, blows through the radiator of the tetrode. Okay, that is the that is all my homebrew amplifier, and uh, uh, thanks for watching. If you have any questions about uh, RF amplifiers, we can uh, have a talk. You uh, simply comment under my video. Thank you very much.